Hello everybody, welcome back to another Fallout 4 guide. This one is a good one today, it's for all of you new people who are just exiting Vault 111 and it's a tutorial very quickly how to get yourself a really nice powerful set of uh, power armor very early on in the game. Um, pretty much as soon as you come out of here you can get it within three minutes uh, it's that easy maybe four at the very most if you're a, a bit of a slower walker so how are we going to do this well first thing we're going to do is head from vault 111 just down the road through sanctuary to the red rocket truck stop once you get there there's a little underground cave and underneath there you can pick up a uh, power fusion core that powers your uh, suit so then after that all we're going to do is run from there to there, in between the robotic disposal ground and the USAF satellite station, Olivia. And uh, yeah, that can be done in a couple of minutes. So uh, very easy. All you've got to do is make your way down the mountain. And then uh, from the mountain, you're just going to head over there towards uh, Sanctuary because you need to cross the little bridge. You could probably swim through uh, the river, but you don't want to give yourself too much rad poisoning early on in the game. Now, this can be done at any time. Um, in the game so if you've not just left the vault don't worry it will probably still be there uh, unless you've moved it yourself so uh, yeah this is just mainly because you can get it from the very start of the game but if you're right near the end of the game and you miss this you can go back and pick it up very easily uh, to get yourself a fusion core and uh, off you go but uh, yeah we're heading over this way right now just because we've got to get that fusion core because there's no point in going to get the suit if you can't power it and get in it and use it so uh, once you cross the bridge from Sanctuary, head over to uh, the Red Rocket truck stop. You'll see the Red Rocket right on top of it right there. And uh, all you're going to do is head down the right hand side of it. And uh, just round the back, you'll see this tyre and this crate here. Um, this entrance is literally just there. Um, it's quite well lit up at night actually because these fungus and um, brain fungus and stuff glow. Uh, but you're going to head into the Mole Rat Dem. Now, like I said at the beginning, um, this can be done right out of the vault. You don't even have to fight anything if you don't want to. When you first run in here, mole rats will pop out of there. But you can head to the right hand side really quickly, look for the radiation sign. The power core will be right there. You can just come in, grab it, and then run out without engaging any mole rats at all. So don't worry if you don't want to fight anything. Run in. You might get a little nip from them, but apart from that, nothing too bad. So, after you exit the cave, we're going to head towards our little marker. I would recommend putting a little waypoint up, like I am right now, at the bottom uh, of my screen. Uh, but I do know the way anyway. So, you're going to be heading towards the robotic disposal site. That blood bug hatchling, best leave me alone, because I really cannot be bothered to, uh, to take him on right now. Even though I will pretty much one-shot him. Can I get up there? Mm, not really, but we can, we can go around. Uh, there'll be a few little rocks in that scale you can run round and things like that it's not too bad really but uh, yeah like I said um, apart from them mole rats in the mole rat den you will probably get a couple of mole rats popping out as you're running through this little forest here as well so don't worry too much about them um, there's a couple of flowers you can pick up on your way as you can see as well so uh, grab as much as you can now there you go, like I said, there, oh there's raiders there, I've, hid, I've headed into a raiders camp by accident for God's sake, don't do that, well I'll remember where they are and I'll come and get them on the way back. Uh, they haven't been there when I first tested this out, so I'm wondering if I'm too far to the left maybe, but uh, we'll make our way up this little mountain here anyway, and uh, as you can see, you've just got to run and scale it a little bit, and uh, you'll eventually pop out over here. Now the robotic disposal site is just there. Then you'll see the satellite dish just there. You want to be in between them, really. You'll see a little plane wreckage in the middle. There you go. In fact, I've just had a good idea. We'll get our power suit and then we'll go kick them raiders' arses. But, uh, yeah, you'll see this little plane wreckage. And then just to the left-hand side, there you go. There is your power suit. And it is as simple as plugging it in the fusion core and then jumping in. There you go. Power armor straight away within about three or four minutes how good is that for the very start of the game now with this you can obviously run faster take the fall less fall damage you can um, what else can you do with it you can carry more weight it really is worth getting there is a mission as well in the game just after this where you head to that little town over there that we've just ran past and uh, you will be able to get a set of power armor but it is a bit badly damaged and uh, 
yeah, it's, it's always good to have a backup, isn't it? So uh, if you can get this straight into the game, um, you can pretty much do what you want. Uh, where was that raider camp? I believe I scaled this mountain, didn't I? My waypoint was there. I reckon it might have been to the right a little bit. Was this it here? No, this is the uh, robotics disposal camp. Ah, I've probably lost it. But anyway, guys, that is a, a nice handy tutorial for you. Really hope this uh, helps. Keep an eye out for more tutorials. I'm playing this game as hard as I can, and I'm going to be uh, doing loads more in the future. So, uh, yeah, if, you've, uh, if this has helped, please feel free to subscribe for more videos. Give the video a like as well. And, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.